Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. The next bend we're going to make is a four-point saddle. First, let's take a look at a four-point saddle and describe it. What we have is a case where we have a pipe that starts on a surface and has to offset up to get around an obstacle and then it has to offset back down to the original surface elevation that we started with. If you look at this, you can see that it's two offsets put together, basically. You want to break it down into components. So let's learn how to do this right now. We're going to use this mark to be the center of our four-point saddle. The block we're using, remember, is 16 inches wide. So the edge would be eight inches away. But we're going to clear the edge by two more inches. So we're going to have to make a mark 10 inches away on this side and, of course, the other side 10 inches away to clear the other edge. And you don't have to use two inches. It's just in this situation, it works out well for us. But you can use whatever is appropriate for your application. Okay, now we have to mark the pipe for the other uh, bends. Now, remember, our block was 8 inches in depth and we're using a 30 degree angle and the multiplier is 2 inches so 8 times 2 is 16 so we have to mark 16 inches away for our bend and of course on the other side we're going to do the same thing we have to mark 16 inches away for that So now it's time to make our bend. I'm going to use the star for these bends. So I align my bender up with the star on my mark. And again, we're going to use a 30 degree angle. So that means I'm going to bend it. Get my bender handle so that it's almost vertical. Check with the level. Okay, a little bit further, so I'm going to take a little bit out. Okay, I'm going to go with that. Okay, it's time to make a next bend. So I'm going to use an air bend on this one. We've done this technique before with the offset. So I'm going to put my mark on my star. Okay, and I just line up my pipe, make sure it's nice and straight. I'm going to make an air bend all the way to 30 degrees. Okay, I can see 30 degrees there. Now it's time to go to my next bend. Now here's the center and my mark past it is at this mark. So I'm going to take that mark and I'm going to put that also on the star. And once again, I'm going to line up my conduit and make another air bend. Okay, now for the final bend. side of the conduit but I can see it on the bender mark here. Again I line that up with my star point. Then I look down my conduit and line that up. And it's a 30 degree bend.
Okay, so now it's time to see how well this fits. So let's take a look and see how well our pipe fit over our block. You notice here, we're flat on both sides. We have a nice offset up, flat on our block. We're centered over the center, and our, we have our bands about two inches away from the edges of the block. So this is a four-point saddle. Now, let's make this a little bit trickier. Let's work from a fixed point. Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. If you find this video helpful, please consider donating using the PayPal link below. Thank you.